jets have been hit massive intelligence failure. It's missiles filmed by our BBC team in Gaza. Jets have been hitting what they say are Hamas positions. But many civilians have also been killed in this densely populated Palestinian enclave, blockaded and nowhere else to flee. Tonight, this is as close as we can get to Gaza itself, about five kilometers in that direction. There is a lot of military activity, jets overhead. Israel has told its citizens living nearby to leave. It's not clear. Give escalation. Hezbollah has been firing rockets into Israel from neighboring Lebanon. They say a show of solidarity with Palestinians. This region has long been a tinderbox. And once again, the flames are being fanned. Jonathan Beale, BBC News, Southern Israel. Border with Gaza. Caroline Hawley reports. Moments before, at a festival that brought... <laughs> Don't kill me, she pleads, as Noah Agamani and her boyfriend Avi Natan are both taken captive. Both are still missing, thought to have been taken into Gaza. Is of Shani herself are too upsetting to show. We were sent a video. He's a 26-year-old British. We don't yet know what's happened to all those who came in these cars to party, to celebrate, with those who survived. But the brutality of the attack.